Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I've done a few videos on curling pages. And somebody asked me via email how you could do two curls on the same piece. Well, I didn't know, but I played around with it a little bit and figured it out. So we're just going to draw one. Just draw a rectangle. Make it whatever color you want. Then go to Effects and 3D Effect and Curl, Page Curl. I'm going to pick the left right-hand corner or left top corner. And you, I've done several videos on this. You can change the, the width and make it thicker. You know, you can make it longer or shorter. You know, just a little bit. I think it looks better when the whole thing's kind of, you know, if you went all the way. That's pretty cool. But you can't do the other corner. You can't do two at once. I've tried. I've tried several times. But just hit OK. Now here's the key. And this is only for printing. I'm a laser engraver, but this, would, I think, would print. Go to bitmaps and convert it to a bitmap. Then go back to effects, 3D effect, page curl. And then this time, pick this corner. It allows you to do to both corners. And, you know, you can change the colors um, of, you know, the curl. That looks pretty bad. And that might be because now it's a bitmap. So, let's do that again. Go to a 3D effect and page curl and pick that bottom corner. And then say OK. And what I did also to put a little background on it, if you hold down the shift key and hit your rectangle tool, it'll put a rectangle around it. And then you could put anything in the background, go up to object, order, back a page. And that looked terrible, but, uh, you know, if you pick that blue or even the dark blue, that looks pretty bad. But you could take the, hold down the control button, add a little white to make it a little lighter. Uh, you could add a little purple and get a total different look. So there's how you could do a double curl. Anyway, I hope that helps a little bit. Thank you for watching.